Hello everyone, I just put the PetroSavers engine oil refiner on my 2001 Toyota Echo. It used to be on a different car and now I put it on this car. Um, PetroSavers engine oil refiner, it says providing clean oil continuously for every engine. We guarantee 100,000 miles or 6,000 hours between oil changes. Now even though it says that, um, when I researched it further I found that you actually never have to change the oil. Um, you just keep changing the filter that's inside this, the refiner element. So here's... Let me... Hang on, I gotta refocus the camera. Okay, I'm rolling. I had to stop the camera to refocus my camera. Um, this is just showing where I installed the the, the HD10 PetroSavers engine oil refiner and uh, it's made in the USA as you can see there right there and the inlet here is coming from the engine and then the outlet goes back into this is the outlet here okay and I'll show you where I hook that up I also have a this here. I don't know if you can see it. No, it's not focusing. But this is a where I can I can drain some of the oil to have it sampled. A sample done. Okay. Let's look at the top. Let's see if we can get the light down here. That's what was happening the other night. Yeah, the, okay, we're still rolling. Oh, you want to use the big light? Okay, so then... Use the other one. Yeah. Just to, the... Yeah, the other light was fine. And just point it down on the hoses here. Yeah, so there's the... Built the hoses. That's the oil pressure sensor right there plugged in going into a copper line that I ran into the to the engine and then this line is the return and it's it goes back into here to the valve cover and it just returns the oil back into there at approximately 2, two psi very low pressure um, so with the Petro Savers engine oil refiner you never have to change your oil and it also reduces engine wear by 95 percent and this has been tested and scientifically proven and all that information is available to you if you would like to research this yourself um, so it reduces engine wear by 95 percent because it keeps your oil clean at all times and I'm, at the end of this video I'm going to show a um, a printout of showing oil being tested, the oil analysis being done up to 300,000 miles and it's still going. The vehicle that, 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 that the analysis was done on, this is information that I request to research and um, it shows that the oil is still very very clean and, 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 and in usable condition. The main thing about the PetroSavers engine oil refiner that I learned was that was different about it was that it it removes the water moisture and it neutralizes the acid that comes from moisture and heat in the presence of the engine oil heat engine oil um, unburnt fuel mixing you know that that gets in there mixed with the oil uh, these things all can, can, can cause an acid to form and that's very bad to have in your engine oil. So when you look for oil filter systems, like there's oil filter systems called bypass oil filter systems, um, those from what I, my research indicate that I, w I was not able to find one that, that refined the oil to the, to the degree that this system did. Um, and to neutralize the acid and to remove the moisture, to remove the unburnt fuel, 
to remove the, you know, removing the, the particles down to one micron or whichever this one does, I don't know the micron size, that's part of filtration, but you have to get that moisture out, you have to neutralize the acid. That's extremely important, based on what I've read and researched. You can confirm and verify for yourself, and uh, I've been using this system, I used it on my other car, and now I'm using it on this car, um, and uh, it works very well. It's a good system. So. Uh, it'll save you a lot of money on oil changes because you'll never have to change your oil again. Yeah, you just have to change the filter. And uh, it's also good for the environment, right? Right, yeah, you don't use as much oil, you're not wasting oil, not putting it back in the environment. Yeah, so that's good too. And, um, and the fact that it reduces engine wear so much is really good. So, uh, that's, these are very important things. To, to learn about to me, they're important to me, and I enjoyed learning about this. And I also want to say that I'm really grateful that this awesome product is available to the public. Um, I mean, think about how great that is, that, that you can actually buy an oil filter that lets you not have to change your oil ever again. And then when you sell that car, let's say you put you know, 100,000, 200,000, 300,000 miles in a car, or even 500,000 miles in a car, and then you want to get a new car, you can keep your oil, your your petrol savers engine oil refiner, and have it installed on your new car. Your mechanic can install that for you. Uh, and if your mechanic can't install it for you, you can find a mechanic that will. But it's not hard to install. I installed this myself, and I'm not a mechanic. So um, I I just want to say how grateful I am to petrol savers that for making this and for being so persistent in their research. They spent 25 years, and I believe it's over 25 scientists as well. That, that found a way to create this, this uh, engine oil refiner. So it's, it's, uh, it's truly a, a great discovery that is sh available to anyone that's shared to, to the world. So uh, thank you Petrosavers. Uh, thank you Ralph LeBlanc um, of Petrosavers and to everyone that, that has been a part of making this product available to the public to buy. Uh, if you have any questions, please call Petrosavers. At the beginning of this video, I showed the phone number. Just call that number. There's also a website, and I'll put, I'll put a link to that on my video. And uh, I'm just sharing with you my experience. And it's been good, and I've been running this filter for over a year on my other car, and I just put it on this car. And uh, it wasn't hard to put on. And... I don't think there's anything else. Is there anything else? No, it that's about covers everything that it has on it. Uh, easy to install and mount. Make sure it's accessible so you can uh, change the filter easily. And drain that section without making a big mess. Yeah, and the oil that you drain from the from, from the Petro Savers uh, to change the filter, the oil that you drain from that canister can actually just be put right back into the to the car once you've put the new filter in because that oil's still good. It's good oil. It doesn't go bad. Not with this engine oil refiner. Yeah, something about the filter that helps rejuvenate and keep the oil lubricating. Oh, and I did want to, that's correct, and I did want to say to you, you can use your favorite oil. If you like synthetic oil, if you don't like synthetic oil, some people don't like running synthetic oil, they just like running ordinary oil, or they have, a, they have their favorite. Um, if you like Whatever oil you like, this, my understanding is, and you can confirm this and verify this for yourself by contacting Petrosavers, but my understanding is that you can run whatever oil you like. Whichever oil is your favorite, you can run that, whether it be uh, sen partially synthetic or fully synthetic or not synthetic at all. Whichever oil you like, the Petrosavers engine oil refiner works with, with your favorite oil, whatever oil that is. Even if it's, the, I don't know if, if, if this is true, but even if it's the lowest cost oil. <laughs> but it's good to get a good, a good oil. I mean, you know, uh, that's, that's just my, my own thoughts. You know, I, which, whichever oil you wish to use, it could be the one that, that's recommended for the car. It could be one that, that you have a preference for. And uh, the engine oil refiner will keep it in, in a usable condition. And when I say that, that's, that, that, that condition actually is a very good condition, meaning to get a 95% reduction in engine wear is that's significant so uh, 
I understand that to be that, for example, I understand 95% reduction of engine oil, I'm sorry, of engine wear to be, and tell me if this sounds right to you, if you put 100,000 miles on a car where you're having the oil changed, um, you know, like, like as recommended, whether it be, what, 3,000 miles, 5,000 miles, some cars are 8,000, some yeah. are 10, some are 15,000, whatever that recommended oil change is, if you do your oil changes like that, up to 100,000 miles, right? And then you have the same car with the same oil, but running, but uh, running the PetroSavers engine oil refiner. The wear on the bearings and the parts that wear out in the engine that are lubricated by oil will be that of an engine that has 5,000 miles. Is that correct? When you reduce yeah, half, wear, half the amount. Yeah. Yeah. When you re when you reduce wear by 95 percent. Yes. That means you're only getting five percent of the wear. That's how I understand that. Yes. So, uh, that's pretty awesome. So that means that an engine, the bearings and you know the camshaft and all the parts inside that move around that get lubricated by the oil, have so much less wear because the oil is continuously being filtered and cleaned, and the acids being neutralized and the moisture is being absorbed into the filter and and whatever else it does. I mean, it does it does many many things. And uh, you can research this with PetroSavers. You can ask them questions. You can request uh, information that you wish to learn, um, and learn to the degree that you, that satisfies you. But uh, you, there's an uh, there's an oil analysis program where you can have your oil ana analyzed through PetroSavers, where they recommend or where they use, or you can go to your own place. That's it's completely your choice. And um, they have a long, PetroSavers has a long history of, of the engine oil being kept in usable condition, as it's called. That's what they call it from the, uh, the people that do the oil analysis. They don't say it's, you know, they don't say the degree of condition it's in, but they do give you the, the uh, numbers. And I'll show you that in the, in, the, in, the, uh, in the last part of this video. I'll show you the numbers of, the, of what's in the oil. Uh, but being kept in usable condition for many, many, many... Uh, hundreds of thousands of miles so it, without any degradation as far as as far as I understand or have seen based on what I've read and researched okay so have a great day and the next part of this video will be uh, the the printout of showing the actual oil analysis of a vehicle that has gone 300,000 miles with the same oil using the PetroSavers engine oil refiner have a good day anything else no. okay have a good day bye Hello everyone, this is the final part of this video, <coughs> excuse me, and it's the oil analysis for a gasoline powered engine that has, that is uh, in an automobile, and what we're looking at is baseline, my understanding of, the, of what this means is baseline is like if you buy oil, a brand new quart of oil, that's the baseline. <clears throat> if you buy a brand new oil and they test it, this, this is what these numbers are here in this row. Okay, And then the oil analysis here on this row is with the vehicle. This particular vehicle has 325,000 miles on it here. That's what it looks like this means. And that's where the check is. So it's 325,000 miles with the same engine oil. <coughs> now, as we go down here, we'll see that. And by the way, if you have any questions about this, this um, analysis, please contact PetroSavers directly and PetroSavers can answer any questions that you have. So here we have metal analysis parts per million. PPM is parts per million. So the baseline, for example, for tin is two. So that looks like two parts per million. And then when we go to the 300 and 325,000 miles 
the tin is at four parts per million, okay? Lead is zero, and here at 325,000 miles, lead is seven. Aluminum is 10 parts per million with brand new a brand new quart of oil, for example, that's tested. And then here, the oil with inside the engine with uh, 325,000 miles is 12 parts per million. Iron, one part per million. After 325,000 miles, 13 parts per million. And this is with regular engine oil refiner element changes. You do have to change the engine oil refiner element. And to get the exact uh, specifications on the frequency of changing that that element, you need to contact Petrosavers. And the oil analysis can be a part of that as well to tell you, you know, how the oil is doing in the in the engine. But there are regular intervals that you can also change the engine oil refiner at. <coughs> okay, so we have uh, let's see, um, aluminum ten parts per million in the brand new oil and then 12 parts per million in the same oil with 325,000 miles on it. Iron is one part per million, and then 13 parts per million at 325,000 miles. The silicone is four parts per million, and 12 parts per million after 325,000 miles. Copper, zero, and then copper, 13 parts per million, uh, with the 325,000 miles. This row represents the engine with in the automobile with 325,000 miles for this particular automobile. Boron is 238 parts per million in the brand new oil that was never used. <coughs> and then uh, only 48 parts per million in the with the same oil with 325,000 miles on the engine with that oil being filtered and refined with the engine oil refiner chromium one part per million in the brand new oil and chromium zero parts per million with the with the uh, Petrosaver's engine oil refiner at 325,000 miles nickel zero with the new oil and then nickel at one part per million here. Silver, zero. Silver, zero. Sodium, two parts per million. Sodium, 59 parts per million. Titanium, zero parts per million. Titanium, zero parts per million. Magnesium, 10 parts per million. Magnesium, nine parts per million. Calcium, 1980, so 1,980 parts per million, and then calcium, 2,060 parts per million. Barium, zero, barium, zero. Phosphorus, 683, phosphorus, 552. And this word is M O L Y B D E N U M. 102 parts per million and 98 parts per million. Cadmium, 0 parts per million, 0 parts per million. A N T I M O N Y, 4 parts per million, 3 parts per million. Zinc, 810 parts per million, 685 parts per million. Viscosity, S U S at 100 degrees Fahrenheit, 270 and 325. This is water volume percent in the baseline is 0 0.05 here after 325,000 miles with the same oil 0 0.05 solids volume percent 0 0.10 0 0.15 
Coolant negative and coolant negative. Oxidation ABS point one mm seventy eight one seventy five. Nitration ABS point one mm forty six. 109. Okay, if you have any further questions, please contact PetroSavers directly. I hope this video, video was helpful to you, and thank you for watching my video. Have a nice day. Bye. Again, if you have any questions at all, please contact Petro Savers. Have a good day. Bye.